71% of the Earth is covered by water. More than 90% of the world's trade is dependent on sea freight. Nearly two-thirds of the world's population lives in coastal areas. Seaborne trade and human activities in coastal zones continues to expand. And so do the threats. Piracy, terrorism, trafficking, oil pollution and other illegal activities are creating new demands on maritime security and safety. When safeguarding maritime borders and coastal areas, full situational awareness and the ability to manage and control all agents involved is the key to success. The new Saab 340 MSA provides the capabilities you need to meet the challenges out there, to anticipate tomorrow. The Saab 340 MSA provides a flexible platform for maritime surveillance, search and rescue and transport missions. In fact, it's a complete airborne operational system featuring onboard sensors connected to a mission management system, radar, electro-optics, SATCOM and secure AIS and all the comfort necessary for enduring and challenging missions. Based on the Saab 340 airliner, the 340 MSA has been factory refurbished and given a complete overhaul, giving the aircraft a design life and delivery of approximately 45,000 flight hours, or some 30 years of operations. The refurbishment includes a total renovation of the engines, the addition of an extensive sensor suite and a mission management system, among much else. Before takeoff, flight routes and search areas are determined using a mission planning system, MPS, which can also be used for briefing. Mission data is loaded onto the Tactical Mission System, TMS, and the Flight Management System, FMS. In the TMS, target presentations, displays and target lists are all easily accessible. The system communicates with the ground through a tactical communication suite. When a target is detected by any of the radars, the sources are coordinated and the information is stored in a database. It can then be used for identification by the electro-optical sensor. When activated, the sensor turret is lowered from its position inside the fuselage. When an unidentified target is detected, a waypoint marking the target's location is sent to the FMS and for acceptance from the pilot. As the aircraft closes in, the EO sensor's high-resolution TV camera will detect if any small boats are speeding away. If so, their position is sent via SATCOM and video is streamed to the ground and other assets by mobile ISDN. In Marfax, a multi-frequency communication system provides a secure channel for the operator to communicate with the friendly forces that are intercepting the small boat. After the incident, a report is prepared and sent to the ground. When a distress call is received, the position is entered and presented on the map. The radar and SAR direction finder, together with AIS, is used to identify the ship. An emergency signal is picked up and the IR sensor detects debris and people in the water. An SAR kit and life raft is dropped, the position is marked with flares and the rescue operation is coordinated. After the mission, debriefing is conducted using the mission planning system. Data gathered, as well as lessons learned, will serve as input for forthcoming missions. By combining a proven platform and best practice equipment, the Saab 340 MSA has become one of the most affordable, reliable and capable maritime security aircraft available on the market today. A complete system for protection and surveillance of your maritime and coastal domain.